Hello, YouTube. This is Augustus Larch. Oh, oh, allow me to clear the contraband out of the field. Mm -hmm. Is it gone now? Hopefully it is. Yeah. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to make a little uh, video here about uh, my with beverages. You know, everybody loves a beverage. With a long, hard day of work and you like a beverage. And there's intoxicating beverages and then there's soft drinks. And I was a fan of soft drinks. But here's a list of the sodas that I like to drink in the past. And I am an ascetic, so I apply a policy of temperance to every sugary beverage that I drink because I know that it's hindering my metabolism over the long run. Over the short term, it feels great. But that's the whole aspect of temperance. But the thing about this is, is I don't drink soda much anymore. I only drink it in for, I only buy and purchase it for parties, really. Because some people don't drink. That's fine with me. A beverage, a party with soft drinks is usually, in my memory, there much better than a party with intoxicating beverages by far. But here's a list of extinct sodas that have went extinct, and it made me totally lax my enjoyment of the whole industry. The first of all is Crystal Pepsi. I drank Crystal Pepsi every day. It was beautiful. I loved it. And I'm not even a big fan of Van Halen. But I'm going to tell you what. They had a great marketing uh, scheme with that thing. Scheme. Marketing campaign. I'm not going to, like, uh, I'm not going to put people into cages by calling them their, their planned schemes when they put their lifeblood into it. But the first one was Crystal Pepsi. I loved it. It was great stuff. It was great, great stuff. And it went off the market. Gone, 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 gone. And then I went off soft drinks. I mean, they took Crystal Pepsi. They're not going to get me for a while. And then Sprite Remix. Ooh, coconut flavored soda. Oh, I loved it. I loved it so much. I drank that every day, too. I even bought cases of that for the weekend. Well, I bought two 12 packs. There are cases now in the supermarkets. I've seen them. And I'm saying, if they have a case, a suitcase full of soda, they should put diabetes. That should be the only label they should be allowed to put on it. Right on the label. Diabetes. Because that's what's going to get you. If you're drinking cases a time of soda, stop right now. I have a love for humanity, and that's not good for your human person to drink that much soda. But I'm getting, I'm digressing right now. Sprite Remix went off the market, and I stopped. And then I said, I don't need a carbonated beverage. So then I drank Claire Brun. Claire Brun, it was mineral water. It was carbonated, actually. But it, there was no sugar in it. And I loved it. Off the market, gone. So then I went to Sobe. Sobe Lisbeth. And I keep the container. I keep the container. There's some leavings of contraband, but leave it. Pay it no mind. Pay it no mind. This is Sobe Lisbeth. And it was also coconut. And it was wonderful. There was a... a a m amount of sugar in it. Oh, the ingredients is still here. Filtered water, high fructose corn syrup, maltodextrin, which is a starch, very sweet, so it has two kinds of sugar. Non-fat milk, cream, natural flavor, pectin, absorbic acid, vitamin C. Whoa, I caught it before the parentheses. And then other stuff. But anyway, this is a good drink off the market. It's not available anymore. Not available for me. After that, soda and any sugary beverage became extinct for me. You drove me back to alcohol. Are you up? If you can gain some measure of pride from that, you're a twisted, complex individual. And you, you need to coalesce yourself more for the future. But this is my little vlog on the extinct sodas. They're extinct. Except for parties for me. I will still buy... I do like to buy Mountain Dew. <laughs> uh, occasionally, I will buy uh, Canada Dry. And also, I may buy Pepsi. But, other than that, you're extinct to me! 
I don't consume you myself. <laughs> Only at the certain extent that I have a party will I ever buy you. So, if you want to... To the executives out there, please bring Crystal Pepsi, Sprite Remix, Sobe Liz Blizz back on the market, and Claire Brune as well. The unflavored, I like the natural. And I know it's the same thing as club soda, but they had more of a kick than club soda. That's why I enjoyed it. It was in handy aluminum cans. Anyway, this is Augustus Large. Thank you for bearing with me. 